guys it's Anna bienvenido otra vez mi canal if you're new here what's up I keep saying that but we're all new to this channel I'm gonna take this off because the jingle jangle is that I cannot right now we're gonna do a little bit of a Ross haul so I don't always have the best luck at Ross especially like in the past with like clothing just like it was not really it for me but this day I found so much and we actually ended up going back to the store. Was it the same day? It was the same day. I ended up going back like a few hours later because I finally tried my stuff on. I didn't try it on there in the store like I should have. I tried it on when I got back home and I thought about it and thought about it and I had to get another one of a dress. Spoiler, they didn't have the dress, but I got like a five more. Yeah, I think I only actually picked up dresses and pants. I have been on the hunt for really nice cargo pants. I have not been able to find any at the thrift store. Even when I look like in the guy section, it's really weird, I just cannot find any. So I've been on the hunt for that and for summertime dresses and I found both of those things, so. First thing though that I will show, I already took the tag off because I almost wore it the other day and then I decided not to. They were pants that I got on clearance, as you can see, for $7.49. Pants were originally $14.99, got them on clearance. What is that, like half off? They are just like joggers. Very 90s, <laughs> but I love them. So they are just plain black. They are cinched on the bottom, which isn't really my favorite because I just feel like it's not a good look for my body shape, especially right now, the chunkiness that it is. I'd rather have the option of scrunching it if I wanted to, but it's fine. These are still cute. They were only $8. Love them. They're by the brand. I don't even know what that is. It's from Ross. I will try everything on for you so that you guys can see it. And I will also have trials and stuff on my TikTok and maybe my Instagram, I don't know. Then, the first dress. Did I try this on already? I don't even know. It has a little hole in it. It looks like it has a hole from the tag, or a tag or something. I don't know. But it's a dress by the brand Parallel Skies. I got this for $15.99 and I love the look of it. It's like very, very summertime. It's cute. This like really pretty blue and white. So let me see what the fabric is because I feel like it's supposed to kind of look like a linen. Is it linen? Oh, it's cotton. 100% cotton. I'm excited about this. The colorway is just like perfect. I love that it's short sleeve. Um, I love that it's actually a button up. If I wanted to, I could use it or wear it kind of like as just like an over shirt, like over something or a beach cover up, like a swimsuit cover up. Wear this to like the boardwalk when you come off the beach to go eat. More pants. I'm just gonna go over stuff as I pick it out of the bag because that's just how it's gonna happen. <laughs> so I got a few different pants, but they're like the same pants in just different colors. I picked up these cargo pants. Love these. Love, 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 love these. They had so many of these. If you see them and you have not picked them up from Ross yet, I don't know about you. So they're by the brand Orange Kiss Essentials. I got a large. I did actually try it on. I think this was when I ended up going back to the store the second time because I was just, I didn't want to get the wrong pair and because I got a few of them. So I was like, I need to try them on. I got a large, the extra large was ginormous on me. So these are only $12.99, which is amazing. The perfect cargo pants. Um, they've got pockets in the front. It's got only just one pocket in the back, but I'm really not mad at it. It's actually got a zip closure. Like what? It's got a zip closure in the front even though it's got a really nice stretchy waistband to it and it even adjusts cinchiness. They're amazing. You've got pockets down the legs. Barbie's here in her cone. And then I do like that they are wide legs at the bottom, but they give you the option to use the little cinchiness if you want it to be cinched around your leg, which I probably won't. If you're trying to tuck them in, I guess, maybe to like some kind of shoe, like some boots or something, once it gets rainy or something do that so here's the gray ones i think i got these in another color we're gonna we're gonna find out what is this i think this is a dress i think this has two parts to the dress i'm not really sure what i'm looking at hmm. okay so i think this is the inner part of this dress i honestly with the way that my chest is so large i need like adjustable straps so something isn't adjustable it's uh, it, difficult though for my life. Here's the inner part, but the top part of this dress is really chef's kiss of it all. This is by the brand, what? 
Mel Gabrielle. I think actually someone else picked this out and they did not want it. So they gave it to me, but I haven't tried it on yet. So where's the tags? I got this. It was $14.99. It's a good price, but only if it fits. I love the material of this. I love again, it buttons up really nice cover up for summertime. It's going to be like perfect um, for really hot days, which it was like 100 million degrees the other day. It's got the belt to like wrap around it. I just really like it. And then you get the underpiece, so it's the two pieces to it for $15. And if you don't have a chest like me, you don't have to make sure that you get like adjustable straps. It's perfect. Another black dress. This one. I almost didn't get this one i did try on because i was super excited about it did i try some of these on already when i got home maybe i did i think i tried on a few because i was just excited this one though i was really iffy about i was iffy about it though because of the shape when i look at it just like hanging up it doesn't really look like much but also bodycon dresses i feel like usually do look like that it's by this brand culture code contemporary fashion culture code okay so there's the tag i'm trying to focus on me though i got it for $13.99 and look at the detail though to the material love that it's all throughout it's just the shape of it is kind of like a mermaid dress which really made it interesting to me but that's also why I was like this could either go really really bad or it's gonna be amazing if you really like it I tried it on and showed someone they said it looked good their black dress this one's um a little bit more casual it's by the brand oh my god JG what is that don't know but i got it for 15.99 i'm pretty sure like soon hopefully in like a few weeks this stuff is probably gonna go on sale but if you find these grab them okay i really like again lightweight i love the like neckline and detail on the front i love the teeny tiny bit of poofness that the sleeves have to them it's got a really nice cinched in spot on the waist and then it's really long it does have the lining so that it shouldn't be see-through just love the skirt how it's got like a few different layers to it this one again i really do like again i'm pretty large chested so i have to be careful about like this, what the stuff looks like on the front because not everything will look good was i talking the whole time i was talking the whole time with my lip gloss looking like that oh my god no one told me dresses i'm telling you this bag was like Full. love this dress i feel like it can come off as very cheap looking but if you do the right accessories the right shoes and a really cute nice quality looking bag i feel like it'll make this look a lot better it's by the brand is this the same one miel yeah miel gabrielle same brand 12.99 for this dress it's very very thin though like you can already see maybe like through it but it's very thin but again i love the neckline and the front you can button it up like close it up a little bit if you want to again it's got a little bit of a cinch around like your thinnest parts <laughs> and then the dress again is very very cute the like skirt part of the dress i just love this design all over it kind of reminds me of vera bradley bag i think it's super pretty does it have a lining it does have a little bit of a lining but again very very thin really nice for a hot day really nice for the beach another good cover up i feel like most of these dresses that i got are gonna be really good beach like swimsuit cover-ups this one i think i actually got this i got this for my sister because um this is not gonna fit me but it was just too cute to pass up so i grabbed it for her it's got adjustable straps love an adjustable strap um it's by the brand justify so it's not like super spendy but it looks super cute it is a dress it's got a little bit of a cutout in the front <laughs> which again <laughs> wouldn't work with me um, and then it is a maxi dress but my sister's kind of tall so it might kind of hit her like at her calves or something i don't know she's gonna have to try this on the price of it was just like i couldn't leave it there 3.49 it was on clearance for three four dollars this is like goodwill price but you, it's brand new dresses though at goodwill are like more expensive now so might actually be cheaper than the thrift store this dress though is a dress that I'm probably, I have two weddings that I have to go to soon. This is probably one of the dresses that I'm gonna wear to one of those weddings. Maybe, possibly, it's a very good contender. And I almost, I almost didn't get this dress because it didn't have the price tag on it. Love this, okay. Do you? It has a little bit of glitter in it, so if you don't really like glitter, 
there's that but i love that it has a little bit of cinch to it it is a high neckline this is really stretchy though so it's super comfortable i did try this one on because i wanted to make sure it fit the sleeves i like because i have chunkier arms right now um but if they had cinched probably would have been a little bit better i love the length of it i think it hits me maybe right at my knees if i can remember well the nice thing about this is it's calvin klein like I said, when I found this on the rack at Ross that day, it didn't have a price tag on and it was literally the only one that I found in that entire store. I was like crazy trying to find it because I was like, if it's too much, I'm not getting it, right? But it's super cute. Got up to the front and I brought another Calvin Klein dress with me. It was like the only other Calvin Klein dress that I found there and it was like $15. She ended up scanning something. I don't know if she scanned the like retail scanner and it was only $12. It rung up or she gave it to me for $12. I don't know what happened. She was like $12 and I was like, yes, put it in the bag. I'm taking it home. Original though, suggested retail from Le Calvin Klein. And I got it for $12. $170 dress that I got for $12. And it's so pretty. Now though, I wish, if I found that in like brown or red, or even a pink, I would be happy with a pink even. But a brown or a red, Ooh, another dress that I really, really like. I feel like you can kind of tell which ones are like my favorite. Like it's super, super excited. Like disgustingly excited. Oh, this is inside out. So I must have already tried it on. Oh my gosh, I love this dress so much. Oh, should I not pick this out? Someone pick this out for me? someone picked this dress out for me i love how this dress feels this one just feels a lot better quality than like this one it kind of feels a little iffy if you're like into fabrics which i am this one feels so much nicer it's by the brand new look which i mean i don't really know much about it but it was on clearance 9.99 they were trying to sell it for 14.99 um, but I love everything about this. The fabric is really, really nice. I love the stretchy neckline. So it's like you can wear it up on your shoulders or you can kind of stretch it down and wear it like off the shoulder a little bit. Sleeves are a little bit iffy for me because again, I have chunky arms right now, like very chunky. It's okay. The front is cute. Where is it? A little bit of button action. You've got this little drawstring waist around here. And then it's a long dress. Is it a little bit? Oh, it's a high low. So it's like higher in the front than in the back. So really like this, love the colorway of it. I think it's adorable, super comfy. Oh, it's rayon, why is this so soft? I still have so much left in this bag, oh my God. Shirts, I forgot that I got some t-shirts. Had to, it's a little Betty Boop. It is supposed to be like a crop top. Oh yeah, it's like cut off. So it's got like a nice cut off bottom but look at that little miss betty boop 6.99 for something knit was that supposed to be the shirt i feel like that was maybe supposed to be for the shirt for 6.99 i think it was another shirt that if you guys have seen my thrift haul it either came out right before this one i think it came out before this one maybe after i don't know when it's gonna come out but because i found this after thrifting my little ponies but I got this on clearance. Can you see that? $3.49. How cute is this? Someone picked out this shirt for me and it's super cute. And funny thing, the lady that was checked out like right before us, I saw that she had the same shirt. So I was like, it was a good choice then. Very likable shirt. So it's cute. I love the brown. Again, I don't really have that much brown in my wardrobe because I just don't feel like it like looks all that cute on me. Barbie, can you, are you able to see her? Oh, Barbie. I really like the detail. And this one was $7.99. Found this hoodie in the guy's section. Because of course I did. Found it in the guy's section. It was on clearance all the way to yes. Just looks like this. I love guys' hoodies because they're just so oversized. Like, I can get an oversized girl's hoodie, but it's just not going to fit the same way a guy's hoodie is. It's just not. Okay. 
Um, this is by the brand Party Pants. I have no idea what that means. Uh, moisture wicking, technical fabric, so it's fast drying. I don't care about any of that. I cared about the fact though that it was on clearance for $4.99. I don't know why it's like so hard for me to see now. It's like all crinkled. They marked it down a few times, but I got it for $4.99. But the suggested retail, suggested retail for this was $90. I need to get XXL hoodies, and that's why they're so nice. I don't know, but the back is just plain. Um, I do love how the black part though goes across to the arms as well. It feels like it's gonna be super, super soft. Is this a pullover or does it zip? It does pull over, but it has a little bit of a zip accent to it. I actually really, really like that. It even has the little tag on the front, on the pocket. $5. That, again, is like thrift store Goodwill price. But it's brand new. What is this? Oh, <laughs> I was like, what are these? So these I picked up because of the price. Like, as soon as I saw the price, I was just like, mm, it's coming home with me regardless. And someone can wear these pants. It's very rare. I barely ever find the 49 cent stuff at Ross, but when I do, I just get extra excited about it for some reason. When it's a clothing item for only 49 cents, you know it's coming home because it's gonna work for somebody. Literally 49 cents. They're just black plain pants, but they're not my size, I don't think. But I mean, I'm gonna try them on, see if we can make them work. They have Brooke. No, they're stretchy. They might be way too big, but it's like, I could wear them as pajama pants. Or some I could like see if maybe someone can fit them. They're just black. Oh, they're really stretchy. I didn't realize that. Loose fitting pants, but again, they're like large. 50 cents. Obviously cheaper than thrift store. This is the same brand. I feel like this is a different brand. Are you okay? You okay? Are you okay? Ooh, I need to put product in my hair. I think this is a different brand from what I showed before. Um, Love Streak. Um, I got these for $10.99. Again, this is a pair of pants that I'm pretty sure there was like a ton of. This one, so I did get an extra large. Maybe these were the ones that I only found one of. Pocket on the thigh and then a pocket a little bit lower. It is the wide bottom but it's got little cinchy so if you want to wear it cinched you can wear it cinched if you don't you don't have to but we love the opciones right um it's got pockets they're very thin love it for those hot days i just ripped this tag off how did that even happen i love the color so these are the same brand as those blue ones so i got the same size so i think there was a lot of these they're just the same exact thing oh i didn't notice i didn't say the blue ones have a stretchy waist also simple plain lightweight if you're traveling, these are going to be perfect to travel in, especially if you're going to like the beach or something. They're not going to take up a lot of space in your bag, but they're a gray color. Again, you got two pockets down the legs. Is it on both too? It is on both legs. You can cinch the bottom if you want to. Love these. I'm pretty sure it was the same price, right? Why was it? Why is it a different price? This one was $11.99, but probably my favorite pants of the day, even though I love all of them. Pink that I almost didn't get. But then I got reminded that um, I'm getting my Barbie Crocs and I was told that I should wear these at least one time with my Barbie Crocs. So I got them. They're literally the same exact ones. Um, they're the same brand Orange Kiss as the very first ones that I showed. Again, it's the stretchy waistband, but you also have the zipper and the little clasp on the front pockets. It's cute. The perfect pink color, tons of pockets. And then again, the bottom, you can cinch it if you want to or you don't have to. They're just the perfect Barbie pink. Cannot wait to get my Crocs. I think they get here in like two days. But hopefully, they're going to fit and they're going to match these. And I'm going to be living my best pink Barbie life, okay? That's everything for this Ross haul. Let me know in the comments below what your guys' favorite item was. And the black dress, though. Let me know if the black dress looks good or bad. Yeah, give the video a thumbs up if you want to see more of my shopping hauls. You guys know, though, I'm trying to save money. <laughs> I hope you guys find the best stuff at Ross, Marshalls, TJ Maxx, all of those places. Muchísimas gracias for watching SWDale, and I will see you guys in the next one. You can say bye to Barbie, too. Bye, guys.